Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and today's video is such a last minute video because I have my mana grading submission return video. I'm so excited for this. I literally received this in the mail two days ago and it's currently Thursday. I have to upload this Saturday. So I am so excited. I just want to see what my grades are. I don't want to wait a whole week to find out what my grades are. So I cannot wait. I'm so excited because we have some really insane cards in here. So I don't even want to talk about anything else. I don't want to mention anything else. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. Also, I just want to say if you can hear background noise, I'm sorry. It's my neighbor. They're doing something out there. But as you can tell right here, I have two boxes. I think I submitted around 30 cards ish, 20, like a little less than 30, maybe 30. So I'm going to take them out of the box and I'm going to stack them and we're going to reveal the grades. So as you can tell, we have a lot of cards. I'm trying to go in order. I'm pretty sure they send it back how you submit it, like the order. Like I submitted some SE cards. I want them to be on the bottom. So, so are two stacks. We're gonna do this stack second because I think it has the goodies in there. Okay, so I just reorganized these cards. I didn't look at any of the grades or anything. I just, they were kind of backwards. So I'm going to start with this stack first because that is the dino cards. And the last card that I reveal should be the SE cards. Okay, so starting off, we have the Konohamaru and Hanabi little dino S, um, CP card. So let's see what we, oh, also with little dino, they are, really not the easiest cards to grade they always have like kind of iffy quality cards so the fact that this got a 10 is insane and it's such a pretty card i really hope my sakura and sasuke ones get a 10 because that would make me so happy but we got a 10 our first card from the stack that is a really good way to start off this video this is an absolutely stunning card so i am so happy that it got a 10 and also let me know in the comments as i go through what your favorite cards are that i got and you know regardless of 10 9 whatever they are so next card we have the Sakura and Sasuke and another 10. This is actually like the Sakura Hara now. I, I think it goes by the color like this is pink so it's gonna be Sakura. All the pink ones are gonna be Sakura. The blue ones are gonna be Sasuke cards. This got a gem mint 10. Another 10 for a little dino for this amazing CP card. This is wow i what a beautiful card an absolutely stunning card i am so happy next card we have i believe this is the sasuke cp but it has sakura in it okay we got a 9.5 we got all 9.5s around the thing this is a stunning card and a 9.5 i'm not upset about especially with little dino little dino is notoriously hard to grade so i'm so happy and just the fact that we have some sakura sasuke cards in little dino just I had, no matter the grade, I need to have it, but I do need all tens low key. This is my second favorite of the four that I submitted. So let's see what it gets. Okay, it got a 9.5. That's okay. It's a beautiful card. I really like it just cause like Sakura's wearing her cherry blossom kimono. Her eyes look insane with this card. And it's just a really beautiful card, but a 9.5 is a good grade. Now this is my favorite one. This is probably hands down the best CP in the set, in my opinion, not biased at all. So let's hope we get a 10. All right, the corner's got an 8.5, bringing it down. This isn't a bad grade though. I really love this card so much and a 9.5, I'm really happy with, honestly. If, even if it didn't get a 10, I'm so happy with a 9.5. This is a stunning card. Absolutely love these little dino cards. Moving on, we have the original Naruto trading card back from like the 2000s, like 2007, 10, some around those times. I don't really remember. I know it's like all soccer cards, maybe like a promo of the successors, which is a really sick card. I don't think it's gonna get a good grade, but it's a really sick card. So starting off though, we have, ooh, we have the Sakura promo card. It got a nine, so it's not the best grade. However, this is a stunning card to just have slabbed. I love the foil on this card. It looks so pretty. And the original Naruto cards are so underrated. They're just so pretty and they're really awesome. This is a really sick promo card. And a nine, so not bad. I think I only submitted two original Naruto cards. So this is probably the successors. This is seriously one of the sickest cards in like promos and whatever. So let's see what we get. Oh my God. This is easily the worst grade I've ever gotten. I did not expect it to get a good grade at all because it was kind of really off-centered. And I guess the surface is really messed up because it got a six. So that's okay though. This is a really sick card. Like, look at this card. Then we got Sakura with little slug, Naruto with the little toad, and Sasuke with the little snake. Such a beautiful card. 6.5 was not what I was expecting. I was expecting like a 7.5 or something like that, but that's okay. Moving on, we have now Naruto Kayu 
for the remainder of the returns. So starting off, we have our UR. It is my favorite Sasuke, one of my favorite Sasuke URs. Him in the last, I love this card. We got it in a 9.5, that is not bad. As you could tell, if you didn't know already, where have you been, you must be new here. Sasuke is my boy, I love my Sasuke. So I had to submit this card because I also needed just another card to submit who I think like meet, like, meet the bulk limit. Possibly, I don't remember. Love this card though. So we got 9.5. Next we have the Eno OR. I had to submit this just because it's an absolutely stunning card. So let's see what we get. We got another 9.5. That's not bad. I really want to see some more tens the next round. Like it's just gonna get increasingly better each card. So I hope we get tens coming up because these the next few cards are really good. But a beautiful Eno OR in a 9.5. Absolutely stunning card. I might list this on my Makari. Might not. I don't know. It's so pretty. Now we have these next set of ARs. This is from it's from some sort of box. I don't know if it's from the New Year's gift box. It might be from that. It's the AR set of first Yahiko here. So I'm going to uh, show that first, but it's Yahiko, Conan, Nagato, and Jiraiya. So first we got Yahiko. Yeah, NRSS AR1. So let's see what we got. Oh, we got it in a 10. Oh my god, this is sick. So that's a good start because I try, I want, it would be really sick to get them in all 10s. So we got 10 for Yahiko. That is a really, really good really good start so we got 10 for yahiko now conan my favorite one which i think is also a lot of people's favorite one it's so stunning let's see what we get oh we got another 10 this was so close to a flawless 10 we were just 0.5 off for a flawless 10 for this card this is so stunning an absolutely insane card to get in a 10 and if we get nagato and jiraiya in 10 that would be insane moving on to nagato please um, rip. It's okay. It's okay, Naruto. We love you. Even if you didn't get a 10, it's okay. This is still such a sick card, and it is the New Year's box. So I was right. You can get pull these cards from the New Year's gift box. They're really sick. These are really awesome ARs. I love like the whole set that they did. And now Jiraiya. If we get a 10, we have to resubmit Na uh, Nagato. We have to get another Nagato and resubmit it. Oh. And Jiraiya got a 10, um, a 9.5. If I want to get the full set, I have to resubmit Nagato and Jiraiya, but still, really, really, really sick cards. And now we have this SLR Itachi. So the SLRs are kind of common, but this SLR Itachi is probably one of the rarest. It's the SLR positive, so let's see what we got. And we got it on a 9.5. That's not too bad. I wish we got this one in a 10. This is a really sick card, and we haven't seen any flawless tens yet. I really hope they're waiting in this stack over here because I need some flawless tens. Last time we got a lot of flawless tens, but this time we are not getting any. We are literally not getting any tens. Okay, that's okay though. So we got a 9.5 for this SLR positive Itachi. Such a stunning card. Now we are really heating up with the cards. We're moving on to the SP cards. First we have the Sasuke SP. I really hope these SPs get a 10 because I love SPs and this is Sasuke and Itachi coming up next. So first, Sasuke. Sasuke got a 9. Why am I not surprised? SPs are so hard to grade, so it's kind of not surprising. However, I really wish that he got a 9.5 or a 10, but I'm still really happy with the Sasuke card. It's one of my favorite SPs, so just having that card grade is really sick. Next, we have Itachi, another one of my favorites. Let's see what we got. Another 9 for the Itachi SP. These are early on printings. As you can tell, they are 5 and 6. So these are the earlier printings of the SP cards. But Itachi and a 9, not too bad. Next we have the Tsunade PR card. I actually saw this graded on Mana Grading's Instagram. Make sure you follow Mana Grading on Instagram because they always have some really cool posts going on showcasing some really awesome cards. So I read another grade of this. And it is a Gem Mint 10 for the Tsunade PR card. I love this card so much and I'm so happy that I got a 10. It is so sick and it's so pretty. And once again, this is a really slept on card that I feel like people don't know about because I did not know it existed until I pulled it in a pull game. So a really slept on card. This is really sick and I'm so happy that I got a 10. Speaking of PR cards, we have this card right here. I think this is like out of print and it's like a $20 raw card. So let's see how we do with this card because I love this card so much. It's a Team 7 PR card. And it got a 9.5. Okay, I'm happy with this grade. Having it in a 9.5 is pretty good. And I love this card. We got Team 7. So cute. My soccer looks so cute. Look at them. They This is such a cute card. I love having that card graded. Next, I actually don't know what to expect now. I forget the order that I submitted this in. So we have... 
oh oh my god we got the 20th anniversary promo card i love this card and i got it in a 10 oh my god you need this card in a 10 i'm so happy that i got this graded again and i got a 10 oh my god this might be one of my favorites that I got back so far, having this in a 10. That is so good. Moving on, we have some MRs. This is a pretty big MR right here, this Madara. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got a 10 for the MR Madara. This is a really good one. I love this card and I'm so happy we got this in a 10. This is insane. This is sick. I am so happy. Ooh, that is so good. Moving on, we got Neji now. Another card that I would love to have in a 10 because I love Neji. Let's see. Oh, we got another 10. I am so happy. We're getting some 10s now. Thank God. Oh my gosh. So we got Neji in a Gemmint 10. The centering was off 0.5. Otherwise, it would have been a flawless. Speaking of flawless, we have not seen a flawless. So manifesting a flawless 10 for at least one of the cards. But we got that Neji in a Gemmint 10. Absolutely stunning card. Moving on, another MR. We have the MR Itachi. Let's see what we have. All right, we have it in a 9.5. That's not awful. All 9.5s around the board. That's not bad. I'm really happy with the 9.5 for this card. It's so sick. We have a lot of Uchiha's in this submission, if you couldn't tell, because obviously I love them, but there's so many sick cards of them. So a 9.5 for this MR Itachi is awesome. Moving on, we got the MR Sasuke. I'm pretty sure there's one more MR Sasuke in this, in this bunch. Oh, we got a 10. It took me a second to like realize what I was doing. But we got a Gemmin 10 for this MR Sasuke. These MRs are really pulling through with the 10s because we needed it. So this MI, this is, even though I don't like this design of Sasuke because he looks terrifying, this is still a really sick card nonetheless. Like this is an insane card. And the fact that we got in a 10 is so good. Now moving on to the big MR of Sasuke. Let's hope we get a good grade. All right. We got a 9.5, that's not too bad. I'm not that upset about a 9.5, but this is my favorite definitely MR out of the bunch. However, it didn't get a 10, but that's still okay. Some really sick Ita Itachi, some really sick Sasuke MR cards that we got, you know, slapped up. So it looks really sick nonetheless. Moving on, we have a decent amount left, maybe like six, seven left. So I don't remember what this is. So let's just rip it. Oh, the M, bro, I forgot about this. We got the, and I'm so mad because I wanted this to get a 10 because I needed this in a 10 for my set and I don't have it in a 10 still now. But this, we got a 9.5. This is a really sick card. Easily out of the fall MRs, my favorite is this one because it just looks so sick. We have the summonings. Like how, who wouldn't love this card? But yeah, we got a 9.5 again, just like last time. Then this is probably another of another one of the fall MRs. So let's see, and we got Rin in a Gemmin 10. Now I have Obito and Kushina and Rin in a Gemmin 10. I just need to grade Minato and get it in a Gemmin 10 or Flawless 10 if we want to be lucky because we still haven't gotten a Flawless 10 yet. But we got a Rin MR in a Gemmin 10. I'm so happy with this grade because I love these MRs so much. This is another one of my favorites definitely that I got graded. So happy about that. We're dwindling down now and I'm pretty sure we're moving into like the CRs, BPs, and SEs. So starting off, we got the BP Gara and a Near Mint 9. That's not awful. I'm not upset about a 9 for a BP card. This is my first ever BP card that I submitted. So, and it's Gara and it's really sick. So I'm happy with this grade. I'm pretty sure this card was kind of, you know, in decent condition. Not like the best, but also a 9 worthy. So it makes sense. Now we might have the CR Toby Rama, which is such a sick card. So let's see. Oh! We got the CR Toby Rama in a Gemmin 10. This is insane and this is so sick. This is one of the coolest CR cards. Absolutely stunning card and we got it in a Gemmin 10. And these next few cards after this are big ones. So, wow. Let's just appreciate this Gemmin 10 of Toby Rama CR. Absolutely, like, look at the water dragon in the background. The blue, the colors, it looks so good. The waves in the back, this looks so pretty. Moving on, my last few. Uh, honestly, I know what this card is. This is a Gengar. I'm gonna show this one first. This is a Gengar and Mimikyu. I submitted this as like part of a trade, but I guess there was no other people that wanted to trade. So we got it in a 9.5, really sick card. And yeah, don't really care too much about Pokemon right now. I wanna see these grades. We have my SE cards. First, we have Tsunade, I believe. Please, to the gods out there please let's just rip the band-aids number 73 i have 999 <gasps> oh my god we got it in the gem in 10 
Oh my god, I didn't drop my tent. Oh my god. I'm so sh I'm so happy. I am so happy right now. Oh my gosh, this is a huge car to get. I am oh my god. The only way to make this better is if Sakura also got a 10. I'm so happy right now. This is such a this is even my favorite card so far. The Tsunade and a Gemin 10. But now the end all be all. The last, the greatest. Save the best for last, please. <sighs> oh, it's okay. She got a 9.5 and I'm so happy with the 9.5 for this card. This is a stunning card and like, let's look at them. This is, this is so good. Honestly, so good. These are my two favorite cards that I got back. I'm so happy with the grades, even though I wish Sakura got a 10. It's okay. These are so beautiful and I'm so happy and I will keep these in my collection forever. Wow. What a great way to end the submission. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure you hit that like button as well as the subscribe button and bell notification so you don't miss any future videos. And let me tell you, that was an insane return. The Tsunade and Sakura SEs are my favorite. I'm so beyond happy that we got Tsunade in a 10 and Sakura in a 9.5. Those are insane grades for those cards. So I am so happy. Let me know in the comments what your favorite card was. And yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Bye.